Payday 3. What a roller coaster of a game. When it first launched in 2023, it was anything but smooth sailing. From server crashes, frustrating bugs, and player feedback that was not exactly glowing, the game seemed doomed to fail. For fans who had waited 10 years since Payday 2, the disappointment was real. But fast forward to today, and here we are Payday 3 is starting to earn back its reputation with mostly positive reviews on Steam. How did this massive turnaround happen? Let's break down the incredible comeback story of Payday 3. When Payday 3 dropped, it was supposed to be the sequel everyone had been waiting for a decade in the making, hyped to the max, and following in the footsteps of one of the most iconic heist games of all time. But instead of a smooth release, it was a disaster. Players couldn't even get into the game because of the always online requirement, and even when they did, the gameplay just didn't live up to expectations. The progression system felt hollow, and many fan-favorite features from Payday 2 were either missing or watered down. The community was loud, and the reviews were harsh. Steam flooded with negative reviews, and the game's player count dropped like a rock. But here's where it gets interesting Payday 3 didn't stay down for long. Starbreeze Studios, the developer behind the game, could have easily called it quits, but they didn't. They took a different route they listened. And that's where the story of redemption begins. The devs rolled up their sleeves and started fixing things based on community feedback. Server issues were addressed and patches rolled out regularly to tackle bugs and balance problems. It didn't happen overnight, but bit by bit, Payday 3 started becoming the game it was always meant to be. One of the biggest improvements came with the game's new solo mode, which was a game changer. No more waiting in endless matchmaking queues. Players could dive straight into the action, and it gave the community what they wanted quick, smooth gameplay without the frustration of connectivity issues. This wasn't just a band-aid solution either. The game's entire progression system got a facelift. Now, instead of grinding through tedious, obscure challenges, players are rewarded for what they love most pulling off heists. Suddenly, heisting felt fun again. On top of all that, Starbreeze didn't shy away from its past mistakes. In fact, they leaned into them. Over on their official Twitter, they even poked fun at themselves, openly acknowledging the rough launch, but celebrating every small victory along the way. And this honesty, it resonated with the community. Gamers appreciated the transparency, and it helped rebuild trust between the devs and the player base. A year after its launch, Payday 3 has hit a massive milestone. Its recent Steam reviews are now mostly positive. That's right, over 70% of the most recent reviews have praised the game, citing the improvements and updates that have turned it around. One player mentioned that the new updates made the game actually fun, with smooth progression and rewarding gameplay. Another noted that every update feels like a step in the right direction, with Starbreeze clearly listening to what the fans want. This turnaround isn't just reflected in the reviews either. The game's player count has seen a steady rise. Remember when Payday 3 was peaking at less than 1,000 players on Steam? Well, now it's regularly hitting between 1,000 to 3,500 concurrent players. It might not seem like Payday 2 levels of success yet, but it's a huge improvement and a clear sign that players are coming back and they're sticking around. But that's not all. Behind the scenes, there's been a shakeup in leadership at Starbreeze, which may have contributed to the game's newfound success. The original game director, Miodrag Kovezvik, stepped down, and in his place, lead producer Andreas Penninger and global brand director Almir Listo took the reins. This change in leadership seems to have breathed new life into the development process, resulting in a more focused and responsive approach to updates and content. So what's next for Payday 3? Well, with this momentum, we can expect even more improvements and new content in the future. Starbreeze is clearly committed to making Payday 3 the game fans always hoped it would be. And if they keep this up, it's not hard to imagine Payday 3 eventually becoming a fan favorite, much like its predecessor. 
In gaming, comebacks like this are rare, but when they happen, they're epic. Payday 3 went from being a game that players abandoned to one that's slowly winning back their loyalty. And the best part, this story is still being written. The comeback isn't over yet, and with each new update, Payday 3 is creeping closer to the game. It was always meant to be. If there's one thing we've learned from this journey, it's that a rough launch doesn't have to be the end of the story. With dedication, feedback, and a willingness to adapt, even the most troubled games can find their redemption.